This is Duke University. So for software engineering, the biggest thing they want to see is that you're smart and you can code. If you can show those two things, really nothing else matters. So to, to show those things, intelligence is going to be, in addition to, to attending a school, to, to attending a great school, it's going to be about your GPA, um, as well as what you've coded and what projects have you built cool, interesting projects. So that's going to come out in your coursework, but also in, your, in whatever you've done in your free time. Some of the best things you can do to get to position yourself for a software engineering role at a big tech company is to spend your summer or, or just some free time during school building a company. Go just build, build an iPhone app over the summer and start selling in, in the app store. And that can qualify as a company. That is a company. If you want to look for a program management role, the great thing is that a lot of the same stuff applies. They hire strongly from computer science, but also from other forms of engineering. So do the same thing. Go build something, show that you're smart, and then you can code. Go start a company, and then you, whatever you can do to show communication skills will also help a lot. So Tiang is a great way of doing that, uh, leading projects. But ultimately, it's going to come down to you know, communication skills, intelligence, and passion for technology. So ultimately, for both of these roles, you're doing the, a lot of the same thing. You're coding a lot. You're showing that you can communicate well. And, that you show, and you're showing that you're somebody who everybody wants to work with. Produced by Duke University. Online at duke.edu.